he was separated from consciousness on April 22nd. He woke up after the Bobby Green clash of heads and then ensuing follow-up shots by Bobby Green. And any lip reader in the world could see Jared Gordon say what happened, right? right. And then here he is fighting in June, right? Cutting weight the next month in the month of May. And it just didn't seem like he should have been in this spot to begin with. So I credit the Nevada State Athletic Commission for, for pulling Jared Gordon from this fight. I consider Jared a friend, but uh, this felt like, uh, I don't know if it was manipulation of a medical suspension, Ray, or what it was, but it didn't feel like Jared Gordon should have been fighting. And uh, certainly glad he didn't eat that left hand, given the fact that he was concussed, you know, five weeks ago. Yeah, friend or no friend, we all love Jared Gordon, but hats off to the uh, Nevada Athletic Commission. We're here for the guy's safety. We don't want to see that kid get hurt. And uh, but, but I'm really hats off to them for they're there to protect the fighters. You know, that's why, again, even with steroid abuse, they want a level playing field, right? That's the objective. Everything's got to be level. They don't want somebody to have an advantage one way or the other. So if they're there to protect them, that's a great example of what they did.